here are your latest headlines and updated Kansas City forecast from KSHB 41 News. I'm Caitlin Canoe with KSHB 41 News. Here's a look at your headlines this Tuesday, January 18th. A judge's report opens up the possibility a Kansas City Metro man could have his case overturned. Keith Carnes is serving life in prison without parole for a 2003 murder. The judge's report, though, says prosecutors did not hand over key evidence in the case, and the judge's findings have been forwarded now to the Missouri Supreme Court. Kansas City police will pay more than $100,000 to a teenager who was pepper sprayed during protests in May 2020. The family's lawyers claim the officer's actions demonstrated, quote, use of force without just cause. A KCPD spokesperson acknowledged the settlement but declined to comment further. Did you get this alert on your phone? If so, don't be alarmed. The Missouri State Highway Patrol says this was a test message, one that was meant to stay within the agency. There's currently no word as to who sent out the message, but again, they are stressing this is not an Amber Alert, just a test. Now, here's Jeff Penner with the forecast. Thanks, Caitlin. Well, the high on Tuesday was in the 50s, about 54. Wednesday, the high will be at midnight, 38. 25, that's what it'll be at about 8 in the morning, and then drop down to 18 by 4 p.m., 4 by 8 o'clock in the morning on Thursday. Wind chill value is 0 to 10 above on Wednesday, dropping to minus 10, possibly, on the wind chill. Thursday morning and only getting up to about 17 and then Friday starting at 2 warming up to 25. If you look at the super 10 day forecast Saturday 38 Sunday 42, but if that's a little tricky because just east of here, it'll be much colder just to the west. It'll be much warmer. So we'll have to see how that evolves and then turning colder again next week, but no big snowstorms seen at this time.